company from Norway, Germany and Japan. Lot of people was there. They are doing lot of good research and India also have a great potential for that. I feel that we need to have more luxury double decker electric buses, electric luxury buses. I got about to launch the truck from Ashok Leyland on 100% methanol. The methanol rate is 25 rupees per liter and at the same time the diesel rate is very high. Regarding charging stations, in the national highway we are making 670 roadside amenities and everywhere there is arrangement for charging stations. And at the same time for driver, we also decided that driver should have an air conditioned cabin because when he works for 16 hours, 18 hours, it is to be appropriate because the road safety is a big problem. Every year we have 5 lakhs accidents and 1 lakh 50 thousand death. Today I have opportunity, got opportunity to address the conference in Mumbai. And now the even the company from Norway, Germany and Japan, lot of people was there. They are doing lot of good research and India also have a great potential for that. Our lot of people are doing excellent research. We need to reduce the cost that is very important and improve the quality. As far as the demand is concerned, sky is the limit. But at the same time, for the international standard, we have to maintain the quality that is very important. The huge potential for the export. Even in infrastructure, we are making lot of roads. Our construction equipment machinery maximum is on the diesel. We diesel and petrol is really an economic challenge for the country. Our import is of 16 lakh crore. This is an economic problem and also the pollution problem. In the both ways at any cost, we want to reduce the use of diesel and petrol. We have to find out alternative for that and the Indian alternative is ethanol, methanol, biodiesel, bio LNG, bio CNG, electric and hydrogen. Just three months before I got opportunity to, had, to launch the buses of Bangalore State Corporation, 20 buses pilot project, adding 20% methanol in diesel. At the same time, uh, I got opportunity to launch the truck from Ashok Leyland on 100% methanol. The methanol rate is 25 rupees per liter and at the same time the diesel rate is very high. Probably if we want to reduce the logistic cost, we need to change the fuel. My request to all of you that presently because of electric vehicle, the huge demand is there. Now flex engine, even the two-wheeler like Bajaj, TVS and Hero, they are already export 50% of their production and their flex engine is available now. We are now in the process of starting ethanol pumps in the country. Regarding charging stations, in the national highway we are making 670 roadside amenities and everywhere there is arrangement for charging stations. I feel that we need to have more luxury double-decker electric buses, electric luxury buses. We just issued the tender for electric bus, then for the cost of per kilometer in diesel bus coming to 115 rupees per kilometer. When we received the tender, it was coming 39 rupees per kilometer for non-AC bus and for AC bus 41 rupees per kilometer. There is a lot of saving. Presently, our all state transport corporation are facing big losses. By these electric buses, 100% we are going to formulate new policy on the basis of London transport model and I am confident that 100% we will get succeed in the success in this particular innovation model which we are going to select. As a manufacturer, I am giving you a positive confidence that this field, this industry has got tremendous potential. And for that reason, we need to accept new technology which are available in the world. At the same time in India also, we have got a lot of research. Now presently, the number of trucks available in the country, I have got the number. And particularly, uh, three times more requirement we need, particularly for uh, having transport of material, we need more trucks. Now the mechanism and particularly the mechanical engineering which we are using, we are developing a lot of new technology 
for making of using of different material by which we can reduce the cost without compromise with the quality i feel that the modifying bus body code is very important for safety and control we have already decided to uh, issue the order for that and at the same time for driver we also decided that driver should have a air conditioned cabin because when he work for 16 hours 18 hours it is to be appropriate because the road safety is a big problem every year we have 5 lakhs accidents and 1 lakh 50000 death and out of which the 40% of the death 60% of the deaths belongs to 18 to 34 age this is really a very very big challenge and problem with the country you need to think about automobile safety because this is very important because in the four wheeler now we are making mandatory the belts even the back side people also it is mandatory for them we are taking lot of new initiative in this particular thing and i feel that i just got opportunity to launch lng truck manufactured by blue energy in uh, chakan and actually the one, the capacity how 1600 km in one capacity and uh, as compared with diesel the saving is 50 to 60% i feel that this is the time that we need to reduce the logistic cost truck and bus manufacturer like ashok leland and tata they have already manufactured truck ic engine where we can use hydrogen at the same time in the hybrid engine flex engine in place of petrol we can use bioethanol also i got the car from toyota now the all company majority automobile company has already promised me they can they will launch this car into the market in the electric now we have waiting list for one year the two wheelers three wheelers and electric four wheelers huge demand is there now we are planning for making to formulate the policy for purchasing of electric bus we are already in the final process and for that reason we want to give highest priority for public transport on electricity in india we will require huge number of buses actually that is not that much capacity is not in the country but this is the time that we need to increase our production capacity i feel that presently the potential of indian economy we are the fastest growing economy in the world we are in the agriculture sector in the industry in the infrastructure everywhere we are now uh, the growth is very very increasing and that is the reason that we have to plan and formulate the futuristic policy